to start things off with Stephanie Morgan for the 11th inning. Find the ball, Steph. We want a batter, not a broken ladder. Facing Dominic Hoskins. <laughs> Strike one, swinging. Crazy ball out of the zone, but with a pitch like that, you got to kind of risk it. We want a batter, not a broken ladder. Little blooper back to the pitcher. Going to be tricky to play, though. Throw to first in time. Morgan's out. Here comes Ahmed Khan. He gets another chance at it. That's a ball high. Ball one high. The next pitch from Hoskins will be ball two high. See, that was the same pitch, maybe on the opposite end. That was called a ball. What? Strike one swinging at an inside curveball that was out of the zone. Hoskins may be losing a little bit of his juice. Drilled hard to left field. Nice base hit for Ahmed Khan. Wow, what a throw from Mikey Thomas. He actually almost... Man, that was... <laughs> he tried to get rid of the base hit. Here comes Korang. And what the Bombers need to do is get a couple men on base and have Keisha Phillips come up again. Grounder to the right side. This looks good. I don't understand the foul ball rule. I thought it was only foul. Maybe it's foul after it reaches first. On one to Kerrang. One out, one on. Drilled hard to left field. That one's got a bit of a carry. Nice catch by the center fielder. Holds Ahmed at bay at first. Here comes Ernie Steele. Oh, Ernie Steele's gonna give it all he's got. <laughs> Dominic Hoskins. Ball one outside. Next pitch. Ball two. So if Ernie Steele is walked, this brings up Maria Luna. Drilled over to the left side in between the gap. Throw to second. And that's out number three. And down go the Bombers again in the 11th. So we go to the bottom of the 11th. Now with Julie Dunkel leading things off. Angela has opted to stay in the game. The pitch from DeVecchio. And that's strike one to the inside. One for four today for the center fielder. She's nerfed the ball a couple times out there, but has made some pretty key catches as well. The next pitch. Strike three, and down goes Duncan. This game needs to be over soon, because I'm actually getting a little impatient. There comes Jay Green, the first baseman. Angela's first pitch. Drilled hard to center field, but Keisha backing up for it. Makes a nice catch. And that probably saved the game. Nikki Winston comes up. And there comes the pitch from to him from DeVecchio. Strike one inside the zone. Third baseman, he's got one heck of an arm. He has shown that on defense today. Takes strike two, high and inside in the zone. Angela's 0-2. Strike three. And just like that, the Melonheads. 1-2-3. So any hope to ending the game now has just been dashed. And realistically, all the Bombers need is one run. Angela's holding down the fort on pitching. And here comes Maria Luna. Three for five. Fouled away. Nice little fastball. Swung a little late. Next pitch. 
Gonna be high and inside the Luna. The one one from Dominic. Strike two, swing, but at a ball that would have been in the zone anyway. So one and two to Luna. That's gonna be low. Ball two. Dominic Costin's starting to get up there in the pitch count. Hit hard. Right to Dunkel in center field. Caught for the out, but that was a nicely hit ball. And here comes the struggling Keisha Phillips. Big bad Keisha, one for five today. She'll take strike one on the inside corner. On one to Phillips. That's going to be low. Low and inside. So here we are at the top of the 12th. Hit hard, but up and away foul. Tied at three. Here comes Hoskins' next pitch. Swung on and missed. Swung early. And Phillips pays the price for it. She goes down. But here comes Angela DeVecchio with two out. Nobody on. She can be the game-saving grace right now. For this bomber's offense. The, next, the pitch. Little blooper to the left side. That one should be easy to play. The throw to first. End time. And Angela. You can see she's all kinds of mad. It looked like a pitch she could hit well. Here comes Fernando Diaz. For his fifth appearance at the bat today. He's 0 for 4. Hit hard and away, but foul. And just like that, 0-1. Next pitch to Diaz. Strike two. Here comes the 0-2 from DeVecchio. Hit hard to shallow center. Gonna be hard to catch. Keisha lays out. She does make the play. Keeps that ball in the inch or in the field rather. Field of play. Here comes Maya Woodruff. Who has doubled today. Drilled hard to the right side. Crying's got a nice catch to it. But all of a sudden the Melonheads are in a little bit of trouble. Well, this is a very important play right here. If they can get Mikey to ground out, maybe force a double play. Strike one. The Melonheads looking to strike and end this game. Hit hard, but foul. Little blooper to the right side. Foul on the last pitch. Here comes the 0-2. This is a big one from Angela. Hit hard to the right side. Ernie lays out. What a catch. That looked like he would that looked like it was gonna go over his head, fall into the gap, and Ackman was gonna have to chase it down. But instead, Ernie makes one heck of a leap of, a leap of faith and is able to get it. And now this puts Mary Riley at the bat, who she's very dangerous. In fact, the outfield's starting to shift their motion on her. She'll take strike one on the outside. Angela now going to try and see if she can stay to the outside. Swung on and missed by Riley. 0-2. Oh Here comes the 0-2 to Mary Riley. Strike three on the outside and Riley goes down frustrated. And that is the tenth strikeout by DeVecchio. So after getting into a small jam, DeVecchio is now one out away from getting out of this inning. Here comes Hoskins. They'll take strike one swing. The thing's gonna end. I'm gonna let the video end.